guys, before we get a new start, because the green Skylander goes to Camo. Let's see if Camo is supposed to sing a Christmas song. But anyways, here we go. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Wait a minute. Is there a present you will see? They're punching in the face. Something's wrong with that, blockhead. But anyways, here we go. We get to know to this weekend. Chestnuts roasting open fire. Uh, well, anyways, welcome back to our to know this weekend reaction time, Christmas 2021. But anyways, today is gonna be the top 10 green characters. But remember, it's not easy being green. So, anyways, here we go for over 16 minutes and 9 seconds. It's not easy being green. Hey everyone, I'm Rebecca, and welcome to It's a Good List, the series where It's a good list! I'm a green alpha beast. Hey, there's something not quite right about this. These are the titles you'll see and go, oh my god, Watch Mojo's running out of ideas, but I assure you it's a good list. Today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 green characters. See? Told you. Today's ranking team. You are totally awesome. I'm kind of big deal. Give peace a chance. If you want to be involved in the ranking and debating process for these lists, Come check out my Twitter, at Rebecca Brayton, where every so often I'll ask for your choices on a certain pointless topic. For this list, we're looking at the most influential and iconic green characters in pop culture. We'll be accepting characters of all shapes, sizes, and shades Daddy? of green. However, oh, we'll also really? be considering characters who are Dad, primarily green. Those who wear a green yeah, costume, the, the no matter outside. how iconic, okay. will not be considered. The back or the side? Ever take off that costume? The back. You ever take okay. off yours? Green. Greens are out. Who are only green in the face, like the mask, are similarly ineligible. Green faces? I agree. I agree. Green. He's green. So, are you surprised we gave this list the green light? Do you have a preferred character in shades of emerald, pea, lime, olive, or chartreuse? They're so different. Tell us in the comments below. Here we go. Number 10. The Wicked Witch of the West, the Wizard of Oz franchise. Green characters come and go, but few have enjoyed such enjoying popularity as the Wicked Witch. From my master ranker brain, you know, I would it's say a Wicked Ken. Witch from the Wizard of Oz. Still got the, Wiz. Oz, the Wiz. You still got the Liz. She was not initially green. Who's that? Don't you recognize me, Wizard? Have I changed so much? That being said, 
The wicked witch's Something role is very even. The first evil reality, female was witch. Brightly but definitely does. <laughs> and by the way, Halloween 203 really is coming 2022. Hers is such an iconic aesthetic that when people think of witches today, but perhaps you'll play the Wizard of Oz magic match. And you shall play it before it's soon. Is there a true? No. Of course, with the massive success of Wicked, the character now also enjoys being a misunderstood protagonist in her own right. People assumed because I'm green. I'm Number nine, Mike Wazowski, the Monsters Inc. franchise. James B. Sullivan. Mike Wazowski. He hey, it's a Cyclops. But this little monster is massive. Just, just like Fiona and Anne. Pixar's most memorable creation from the Alpha Beast. Green or otherwise. Mike Wazowski, number like one. Voiced so by close, the Phoebe. incomparable Billy so Crystal, close. Mike Wazowski is a fast-talking, one-eyed green ball of energy. When we first met Mike in 2001's Monsters, Inc., he was working as a scaring assistant to his best bud, Sully. Get up, Sully! <laughs> Proud, charismatic, and Bullhorn! Funny, prone to rubbing people the wrong way in the occasional episode of Selfishness, Mike is a believably flawed character, and that's what makes him so relatable. The fact that that movie has had, like, yeah, the but I longevity know. on the internet. Randall's a like, lizard. A like, especially Mike Wazowski, that's, like, an iconic, if not the most iconic Pixar character. Well, the course of the still got the film, rare ones, as well as a prequel, very but short films, I'm a, and video games, I'm, I'm a mo time and time I'm again, a monster. This little green monster. I'm an alpha beast monster. Yeah. Number eight, The Grinch, The Grinch franchise. Oh my God, it's The Grinch! One of these Christmas characters you saw. How about the aptly named Grinch at the center of this unconventional holiday tale? Beverly Who down in Whoville liked Christmas a lot, but the Grinch, who lived just north of Whoville, did not. As the story goes, what? his heart went from you being two sizes too that, small huh? to growing three sizes in a single day. Created by Whoa. the wildly creative Dr. Seuss, the Grinch is just about the oddest Christmas hero in the history of the holiday. I'm going to steal that Christmas. You steal what? A loner. He's a mean-spirited creature who loathes cheeriness in any form. I for year after year I put up with it now. I must stop this Christmas from coming. But how? I mean, in what way? But no matter how dastardly his deeds, the grin. Grinch has an undeniable magnetic quality, so there, even before his change of heart. Though his color Just left kidding! <laughs> the original illustrations, You'd never miss this. The 1966 film established his now trademark green fur, and the character has never looked. Come like on, it's green. Watch Mojo's version. Are you kidding me? Okay, wait. We definitely need a rhyme in here to honor the author. How about? A memorable anti-hero with skin this chartreuse could only come from the mind of the Seuss. Okay, that's better. Number seven, Frankenstein's monster, the Frankenstein franchise. The horror genre has given us countless creatures <gasps> My goodness, over the years. it's a Halloween trick. Sizes but seriously, yes, do that. Players. But even in a crowded field, Mary Shelley's 1818 literary creation remains among the most instantly recognizable Oops, and influential just characters. just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Never missed that before. Often erroneously referred to as Frankenstein. Yeah, it's a black and white, but trust us, she's Victor green. Frankenstein has shambled Told his way ya. into countless films, books, television series, comic books, and more. But seriously, watch out for fire. Fire bad. Though his skin is occasionally depicted as having a grayish pallor to it, he's most commonly depicted as <sighs> having sickly you, green you flesh to match his undead here. origin. That's right! Thank you, monster nerd! The monster Am I a monster or not? But he's a but seriously, though, being. I'm still and a lizard. Of his I'm just a regular lizard, so but seriously, six, you can. Yoshi, the Mario franchise. There aren't many supporting characters on our list. Wait, today. is this Yoshi a dinosaur? Is making an They're is dino might impact this dinosaur like creature has made. Luigi. Luigi. Um, is it I, Luigi or is it Yoshi? 
It's Yoshi it's be because Yoshi, yeah. Luigi is in green. Though he's a welcome addition to any Mario title, he's more than just a steed for the iconic plumber to ride. Ever since his introduction in 1990, <laughs> Yoshi's popularity is such that he's claimed the spotlight as the hero of his own story in a number of releases, including the excellent 1995 Super Nintendo game Yoshi's Island. Impossibly cute in his design, and with a range of expressive well, noises Well, how to match, cute. Yoshi's name recognition Pop rivals up. that of Mario himself. Yoshi Boogie! Yoshi's running away! He consistently ranks among the most popular video game characters of all time. Number five. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles franchise. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Turtles Mutant for sure Ninja is top Turtles. Five. Is it cheating to but present a everything group of seriously, in a single entry? heroes Maybe. of the half but shell. Like a loving, wise, mutated, adoptive rat father, we refuse to pick a favorite. Get down. Uh, I never touched it. They're monsters. Michelangelo, Leonardo, Raphael, and Donatello are well, seriously, very much their I'm a reptile, turtle. but turtles are reptiles. You said voice. that. But turtles are literally clashes, reptiles. Or rather, shells. Still got the action, dudes. And dudettes. And that's a big part of the enduring appeal of TMNT. They aren't just crime-fighting turtles in a half-shell. They're a family of misfit teenage brothers trying to do the right thing against impossible odds. MC you know, still got the movies. In stringing these four unlikely words together, Kevin Eastman and Peter Laird made it cool to be green. Heroes of the half-shell. Turtle power! Number four, Kermit the Frog. The Muppets franchise. He has that historical significance, which puts him on the list. But like, oh, wait. I, I don't think they, they Kermit saying, from the Muppets oh, yeah, and Sesame Street. When this now both. Famous Muppet and Sesame Seriously, Street both of these. His debut in 1955. He was basically an and old also coat and a Sam and Friends. Why don't you call me Kermit and I'll call you? Uh, uh, well, what would you like me to call you? But something about the way creator Jim Henson brought him to life clicks with viewers. You know, Jim oh, Henson, yeah, Kermit, the creator like, of. Like, Pop the Muppets. green character, if he wasn't on it, they would like bring the torches, you know? It would take some time for Kermit to truly become You're the frog down. we all love today, but he stood out right from the very beginning. Someday we'll You'll find it, it the rainbow connection, the lovers, the dreamers, and me. Something about his design made his personality obvious. <laughs> God, I going, love that song. friendly, caring, and a natural leader but not afraid to make a wise crack. I have lost my sense of direction. Uh, have you tried Harry Krishna? And while fellow Sesame Street castmate Oscar the Grouch is similarly iconic, Will you stop bothering me? I'm sorting my trash here. Is this Oscar? To give it up for the frog who <laughs> It's a commercial. <laughs> it's not easy. Number three, Shrek, the Shrek franchise. Can He's I a sex point? symbol. Sex symbol well, okay. and... <laughs> Swamp dwelling ogre first saw the light of day in the pages of a 1990 <sighs> picture book written and illustrated by William Steig. It generated a fair amount of praise at the time, but it wasn't until Shrek's 2001 feature film that the character well, became a just carry on. After finding love with Princess Fiona in the first out film, Shrek. the titular ogre and Go his on. bride have continued to deliver countless laughs across a number of sequels and related media. While the films remain accessible to all audiences, it's his proliferation as a meme that's taken this ogre from household. God, life you better hurry up because song. Shrek is love, I say. Shrek is love. Of course, <gasps> we can't imagine oh, Shrek ever having become so hugely it's, popular. It's oh my goodness. Had for the voice work of oh, Chris sorry. Yes. You're doing in my, my swamp. Two, Hulk, the Marvel Universe. That's my secret, Kevin. I'm always angry. Wow. 
but he is Hulk, the super monster. But seriously, it's not a super monster, but just like Frankie from just like Frankie. Oh, seriously, it is. Wait a minute, sis. That's not She Hulk. It's Grimora. But seriously, they can't. Harder or longer than the Incredible Hulk. Like that button, right? Raw emotion personified, this complex that queen is created so by Stan Lee wicked. Himself. Hulk it's smash! The Green Goliath has gone through countless changes in terms of his appearance, personality, affiliation, Hulk's and even Professor his Hulk as a hero. Or Shrek? With his inclusion in the MCU, however, it's safe to say that the Incredible Hulk's status as a top-tier green character is more unquestionable than ever before. Yeah. Incredible Hulk! He's... he's... Before we unveil our number oh. one pick, here are some honorable mentions. Hey, Lion, that's... The Ghostbusters franchise. He's an ugly little spud, isn't he? It's you know, Slimer, he's a ghost okay. slime monster. He's an ugly little spot, isn't he? My goodness. He can hear you, Ray. You're going good! Piccolo, the Dragon Ball franchise. He's known as Big Green in some dubs. Well, 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 look who's the side. Did you ever say in. the it's Green the Goblin? He's brought the Green Man with him. Ms. Green Eminem. M&M's. An urban legend in the 70s about green M&M's being an aphrodisiac spawned this seductive mascot. He's green. He's just like a female one, too. The Squeeze Toy Aliens, also known as Little Green Men, the Toy Story franchise. You have saved their lives and they are eternally grateful. Who's in charge here? Finally, Lightyear is coming next year. The claws are master. The Jolly Green Giant. Green Giant Vegetables. The second most popular character to have ho 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 as a catchphrase. Green Giant. Goodness at its best. Ho ho ho. Green Giant. Be sure to subscribe to Hey, that's sort of like Santa Claus. about our latest videos. You have the, the Green Giant and videos, Santa Claus are both the quotes. Oh, oh, oh. Settings, Here comes a number one. Yoda, the Star Wars franchise. I'm looking for someone. Looking? Found someone you have, I would say. Hmm? Sage advice from us. Sage Sounds like Grover Earth. from Sesame Street, There are clearly though. many iconic and beloved green characters. But and I like we it. anticipate a ton of others in the comments below. But... There's no green character more instantly recognizable or inspiring than this mysterious Jedi Master. I mean, how can you not put a character as iconic as... But Jedi still an Jedi. ugly green shirt. Green is to you. That's the entry. It writes itself. Go First go. introduced as an eccentric aging mentor to Luke Skywalker, Yoda has seen his character expanded upon across a variety of media. And the more we learn, the more compelling he becomes. Wise, funny, humble, an awe-inspiring warrior, whether he's brought to life through puppetry or CGI, he never <laughs> fails to impress. <laughs> the difference. Can we, can we also talk about Baby Yoda? And with Grogu, aka Baby Yoda, becoming an instant fan favorite on the 20 show, out of 10 will die? has somehow become even more popular and influential than ever before. The greatest green character Yoda truly is. Do. Oh, do not. There is no try. Do you agree with our picks? <sighs> well, that's all for Watch Mojo's top 10 green characters. But seriously, though, Earth Day will begin next year. And all of that. But you still got the holidays on this list. But anyway, we'll see you tomorrow for another Alpha Beast. But stay tuned, and I'm leaving. Bye, guys.